Hello everyone. In today's video tutorial, we are going to discuss about the application state program in ASP.NET. The ASP.NET application is a collection of all web pages, code, and other files within a single virtual directory on a web server. When information is stored in application state, it is available to all the users. Application state is mostly used to store hit counters and other statistical data. Global application data like tax rate, discount rate, etc., and to keep the track of users visiting the site. In today's program, we are going to count the number of hit counters. So, first of all, open the Visual Studio and create a new website. After that, select your website and add a new web form. Again, select a website and add an, another file that is global application class. The default name of global application class is global.asax. After that, here are the number of functions like application start, application end, application error, then session start, session end, etc. Here we have to write down the code in session start method. So write down application dot lock. The lock method is used to prevent the access to other users. And unlock method is used to give access to other users. But before that, go to the application start and here first write down the application user is equal to 0. Means at the start, the number of users visiting the websites are 0. Then at each visit, we increase the counter by 1. So again in the session start method write down application user is equal to application user plus 1. Each time the counter is incremented by 1. This is an integer value so write down first integer. And then application dot unlock method. Here first the number of users are 0, we increment the user by 1. Now go to the default.aspx page, go to the design view and right click on the page and go to view code. In the page load event, we have to print the number of users. So write down response.write number of users visiting the website or number of page visits are here we store the page visits in application user so write down application user Now run the default.aspx page. Here when we visit the website first time it shows the counter as 1. Again run the program then the counter is incremented by 1. So here number of page visits are 2. The number of times we 
run the program it show, it shows the counter incremented by 1 So this is a simple program of application state and here we discuss about how to increment the counter using application state.